Hello everybody and welcome to uh, this update or this video. Uh, so uh, there's going to be quite a few things I'm talking about. Uh, okay, first, first of all, the Allegro 5 tutorial series is finally done, right? So uh, now it's time to get into the platformer series. Now uh, I want in this video by by the um in the description I by the end of this video whatever I want you guys to post which uh what you guys want in it what you guys want exactly in the platformer I already have some ideas what I want to put into the platformer but I don't know exactly what I want to put into it. I don't know everything I'm going to put into it yet my plans were to have like um sprites this time uh not not just blocks or anything actual sprites uh i was thinking of doing certain power ups or a coin system like getting gems or whatever but like i i don't have it fully thought out yet i want what you guys want so tell me exactly what you guys want in the platformer series secondly for the allegro programmers uh out there who uh the allegro programmers that watch my tutorials uh, please let me know whether you want it to be in a Lego 4 or Lego 5. I know I probably, I have a lot of a Lego, I don't have a lot of Lego fans on here, so make sure if you're a Lego user, specify what you want in it, and if it should be in a Lego 4 or Lego 5. And for, the, for those of you who lose, like, say you're in a Lego 5 user, but I'm doing it in a Lego 4, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, but if I do one for... If they choose a Lego 4 and you're a Lego 5 user, I will tell you what you need to do in order to make it work in a Lego 5 and vice versa. So if I'm doing a Lego 5, right, and you're a Lego 4 user, I'll explain to you what you need to do in a Lego 4 to make it work properly. I'm thinking, I'm guessing a Lego 4 is going to win because a Lego 4 is just more popular. A Lego 5 is fairly new and a lot of people haven't jumped on board with it yet. And uh, so I'm thinking Lego 4 is going to win, but I don't know. So if you're a Lego 5 user or Lego 4 user or whatever, let me know which version you want me to do. Uh, secondly, uh, well, thirdly, I don't know, whatever. Anyways, uh, on July, well, okay, this Friday coming up is my birthday. So I just wanted to let, let all you guys know this Friday, July the 20th is my birthday. So... I don't even know if I'm going to be making videos on my birthday. I don't know if I'm just going to be chilling or whatever, but that should be pretty fun. So whatever, if you want to leave a comment, my inbox, or just say something. I don't care. I don't even care if you wish me happy birthday or not. I'm just letting you guys know I'm putting it out there. I'm turning 19, for those of you who are asking, I'm turning 19 uh, on Friday. Anyways, on July the 29th, I'm leaving for, um, I'm going to Pennsylvania, I'm going to Bloomsburg University for a shootout. If you see my shirt, Keystone State Shootout. So, I've been, I went there in, I think, I don't know when it was, September, October, or some, some time, uh, last year, and, uh, I didn't think I really did really good. I really didn't think I did that great, but uh, there were some scouts there. They said they really liked the way I played. Um, they said they were going to invite me back, and they said there's four scouts uh, that that want they're looking for me, right? So I'm going to go there. I'm going to play. I don't know how good I'm going to play. I've been injured now, and I haven't been playing basketball regularly because I was thinking of just focusing on computer programming, not basketball so much anymore, but... They invited me, so I shouldn't destroy an opportunity. So I'm going to be going there. Um, hopefully, maybe uh, maybe I'll get a scholarship, maybe not. Uh, I don't know, but wish me luck. So I'm going to be I'm going to be going there for the 29th. Uh, but I'm not uh, after I go from Pennsylvania, from Bloomsbury, Pennsylvania. I'm going to be going to New York after that, right? Uh, my my dad my dad is a pastor or whatever and he's been invited to he's been he's been invited to go and preach there so i'm going to be in america from the 29th to august 4th so for five days so for those five days what i'm trying to do uh, i'm trying to make a lot of videos ahead of time so i can still post videos within that five day period those five day lapse 
but I'm not sure if I'll be able to. So from July 29th to August 4th, I don't know if I'll be able to f post a video, uh, but I'll I'll try my best to have some videos available to you at that time. Uh, so yeah, and my brother, I don't know. He, I remember telling you guys that he was gonna do uh, some music production tutorials. He's been telling me that uh, he's going to do it, but he's been really busy with music and doing a lot of stuff, so I don't know if he'll be able to do it, but he said he would try to get to it uh, by like mid to late August, so I'm not 100% sure, but uh, he might get to that, and uh, so that, that is, that is pretty much it so like this that's pretty much it uh just a last thing to note is that i i want to do the platformer series now is because uh the critiques in the beginning the beginner tutorials like allegro hd xna allegro 5 etc uh those were fun but they weren't fun fun you know what i mean it's it's like I retaught the same thing like how many times, right? I retaught it like four different times, uh, just with different APIs, right? But getting into the platformer series is gonna be a lot of fun, right? So I want to jump into the fun stuff, so I'm more motivated to make more videos for you guys, right? So I'm gonna jump straight into the platformer series. But my I my plan, my original plan was to make a C++ made easy and a C sharp made easy tutorial series uh, so we could teach the basics of the language and all, all the advanced and intermediate subjects that we need to know in order uh, for you to understand the advanced platformer series I was gonna do that uh, but what I'm thinking I don't know you guys tell me what you want in the description but I was thinking of just doing uh, either the C++ Made Easy after for those of you who can't or don't understand the advanced series or trying to do it alongside with making the platformer series. If I do it along the platformer series, the platformer series will take longer to finish. That is a downside. Uh, but if you if you want to me to do them alongside each other, then I, I can do it. it. It's up to you though. Uh, so that's it for this update and for those of you who are in Pennsylvania or or that live in Bloomsburg or whatever or anybody who just wants to see me play basketball if you're going to be around the area or something it's the tournament the shootout's going to be on July 29th it's going to start the game start from 2 and they end at 6 I believe but like the whole thing starts at 1 I think the registration and everything so I don't know if any of you guys are from Pennsylvania. I don't know. Like, I, I really don't know. But if any of you guys are from there or are, are going to be in the area, just want to meet me or whatever, then you can meet me. Or you, if you want to see me play, you can do so. So I'm going to be there from 1 to 6 o'clock. And then after, I'm going to be leaving straight for New York. Uh, but if you want to see me in between games or any time there, then you can meet me. I'll be glad to meet you guys. Um, I don't know if you, I'm going to see anybody, but sure if you if you can show up just show up it's whatever so uh, that is it for this update uh i hope i touched on everything and be ready for the platformer series i'm thinking of starting that platformer series tomorrow or maybe even i might even start making the videos tonight uh for the sfml and the xna right but i'm not sure about the allegro so the faster you reply on which allegro one you want to do that's the fastest i can get to it but uh that is it for this tutorial i'm not tutorial that's it for this update thanks for watching hope you enjoyed it and bye